Alrighty, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. So today we are going to be starting our bomber build. So we're just in a blank in the airfield here. The first thing I want to do is we're going to stretch out the maximum length and the width. Doesn't matter where you take your width from, doesn't matter. Uh, and then that way we just have a frame that we're, we're not going to move, right? So then I go back, I don't know, maybe here. Okay. Let's get a three by three. Start with a three by three window. And uh, this is also going to be a one by three. Okay, then we're going to go. Now, I mean, if you want yours to be a bit wider, by all means, this might seem a little skinny. Basically, something like that would be our bomber. Um, let's see, we'll take that for now. So, let's, that's our top, that's our bottom. So I think I went three on the bottom. I think I went one, two, three like that. From the front. It does look kind of big, um, but what I found was that once you get like all your insides in there, you know, your electronics and everything, uh, the landing gear, blah, 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 stuffed into the airplane. And those older hulls, those older aircraft, they were long and skinny. A lot of those, the old war aircrafts were long and skinny. All right, so we can take that. That's basically our, oops, our fuselage now. Let's see if there's a window. Right, and then from here, that's it to there, basically. There's your bomber. So now that's what I did, and then uh, I was like, oh, you know, it's it's a bit skinny. So I did this as well. Uh, did 
I do that? Yeah. And then I had a, a block in the middle, actually. It was, came off of here. this on the bottom as well just to give it a bit more shape well 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 Something like that. This is our bird. All right. It does seem long, but you'll see once we put the wings on. It's not that big. Okay, so now we can chop the nose off. That's fine. So that's kind of the front of it. That's pretty much what I had. And then I just had a seat uh, for now. We'll just put one seat in there. And then we just need a couple of controls. Uh, two throttles. And then the rest, I think we, we can run through the seat pretty well. Uh, battery. All right, okay, so now I want to do the wings. So I found, uh, I found that um, for the wings, just come right out, right out to the end. And I'm like one, two, three, four, five, six, like seven, maybe eight wide. And they come back straight in. But then they also, so we get rid of this. Um, but if you notice, they also uh, go back, right? So they kind of come back on an angle as well. So, Is 
actually kind of do that. No, this goes the opposite way. This goes the opposite way. It's almost like that. It's not quite like that, but it's almost, you know what I mean? It's almost like that. It's almost like that. So this probably straightens out at some point, maybe. back oh they're kind of straight on the front side and then on the back side Now we'll go one, two, three, four. Something like that, only not so thick. Not so thick. I'll do more so something like that. Uh, we could, we could. look at getting our motor so probably gonna put it you could say probably there let's see we want the is it the large one no, it's not the large one. It's uh, rotor end light, propeller end small. That's what we want. Yeah, that looks about right. All right. Then take a gearbox. Uh, modular engine. 
engine parts. Okay, so now we need the three by three crankshaft. And we need six of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, and then we're gonna need room, coolant, and all that other stuff. Okay, and then we need the tops. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then we need uh, the exhaust. Three, four, five, six. Really, this is this is it. Once these engines start, show fly. Three by three built. We need starters. Just alternators. All right, uh, and then now we need some. side like that and then now we need our cooling manifold and then we can go radiator uh, what was the best way to do this was it that way let me see here We still had to do some fancy pipe work. I guess that's not too bad. All right, so. Goodness, I'm so glad we can do this in beer mode. Oh. Function block. We just need one of these, basically. Two there. We delete this now. No, 
there'll be bombs and stuff in here. Oh yeah, then we have to finish off the <laughs> we have to finish off the back side of the of the aircraft. That'd be pretty easy. Okay, uh, and then now we need the radiators. Okay, now gotta build the gas tank. Uh, what did I do here? I think I just did this. So, let's see here, let's get a pump, and this is going to be pumping fuel out, and we'll do this. So all of that is the engines piped in. Okay, then we need a fluid spawner in here. Fuel. 
Okay, now, really we need to connect everything, put some wheels on it, and then finish the back side. So the back side here, um, I mean, pretty basic really. I just kind of, I just did this. I was like, all right, that's where it meets. So, uh, want those control. I don't know if I used medium or if I used large. Medium's probably good. And then uh, the tail here. Yeah, so something like that, you know, whatever. Something fancy there, whatever, whatever that's gonna be. Uh, all right, uh, let's see. And of course, this is probably gonna come up uh, to about there. The tail. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go, something like that. Shabby, not too shabby. Okay, so now uh, we can just pretty well. I, I it's, it's just gonna be quick. I know the tires, right? And then um, I use the by the sevens. Probably there. Probably there, and then in the back, uh, I think I just used the five and five, so let's see. 
Yeah, just to buy a fives. We could do something like that. All right, so then we need one more control surface. Oh, well, we need a couple actually. Um, we can come out even, you know what, here, we can do this, we can do this. We can do that so that pretty well is an aircraft let's get it all connected electrically and let's go from here if this was a mirror bug. Alright, I think that's everything. I guess we'll find out if it's not. So, fuel block uh, the function block we want to say X times 0.5 and then we want to take the function block and we want to connect it to the fuel throttle and the fuel throttle just connect it on both sides and then we want to connect the main throttle to there air intake. Now I had mine set at a maximum of 0.3 so I'm assuming this is probably going to be similar so that's why I'm going to set up a 0.3. This one here is our our pitch. Okay I'm going to set that up to 0.3 as well and that's going to be our pitch. That goes directly to our pitch. All right then what we need is a constant number This could be constantly number one. And that's gonna to go to our collective. That's gonna to go to our uh, alternators. Okay, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this clutch it goes to our clutch yeah I think that's how it has up I guess I'll, I guess I'll find out 
Here, let me uh, let me save this as. Uh, I'll save it there. Let me just load. Uh, let me load this real quickly, and uh, let me just take a look at. Clutch came from there, and the collective. Okay, I had that backwards. Collective is going to be constant number one. Collective is going to be constantly number one. Yeah. And then I did have that right. Okay. And then pitch is going to be no. Pitch and the collective. No. Oh, I'm sorry. W and S is going to be our pitch. W and S is going to be our pitch. One is going to be our collective. And throttle is going to control the clutch. There we go. All right, all right. Now, number one is going to be start engines. Number two is going to be our systems button. So W and S is our pitch. And number one is our collective. And then our clutch is connected to a throttle. And our throttle speed for the clutch maxes out at about, uh, I max it out at 0.3. You can go more, but remember, if you have too much clutch, the airplane is going to want to do circles in the sky. So, just remember that. Okay, that should be that. That should be that. Spawn it in. Oof. That is uh, very long. The wings need to go forward, I would say, just, just a little bit. Uh, Probably, probably there. Just making some adjustments here, just kind of. It doesn't kind of look right. Save it. Spawn it in. So we'll do full on that. Let's see, start. See what's going on here. Oh, I see what's wrong here.
No air intake on the engine. Wait, now maybe the maybe the wheels are a little bit more forward. Maybe the wings are a little bit more forward. I'm not sure. So the systems. Better hook up the seat to that. Uh, we want these to be neutral. I set mine to five. I think it looks cool. Five. Uh, and then let's have the seat, shall we? Okay, so W and S is our pitch. Okay, A and D is our roll. Left and right is going to be our rudder. And then what I'll do is I'll usually put steering on this one. So we can taxi. You usually use taxi with the rear wheel. There you go. 50,000. You know, if it's a bit long, you can always shorten it a little bit. Whatever. Let's see here. You have it. Bomber. Right now, maybe it's obviously it's too long, you know? You can always take it back. Like, this is a sardine. I just wanted to show just kind of. It's that easy. It's that easy. Wow, that is going to do it for part one. That is going to do it for part one. There are no wheels, so we are going to crash. That is going to do it for part one. Uh, in part two, we'll refine it. We'll refine it. We will. It looks a bit long, so change the shape a little bit. Maybe you need to cut the. That's what I did, did on the other one then. I brought the rear in a little bit, brought the nose in a little bit, you know. Maybe we make the fuselage a little wider type stuff. Just kind of develop a shape now. It flies, right? So now we can kind of, uh, we can just sort of add to it, add to the payload. You know, like, yeah, so I think it's a bit long. So what I, what I want to do is, You know, maybe I want to cut that and then, oh, you know what? Uh, let's paste that, let's merge that. Like that. Let's get those batteries also, and then I don't know, maybe we'll go back this far. You know, it's all a big guessing game at this point in time, right? You know, just kind of aesthetics, aesthetics, right? Let's 
say, okay, that looks a little bit better. Uh, now let's focus on the back side, right? Maybe the the rear is too uh, it's too too rear. So we can then do the same thing. We can say, well, maybe uh, it's going to be that big. a bit better. Yeah, I think we can work with that. And that's all I did. And then I just hollowed out the inside. Made it so that way the legs could fold up onto the wings. Uh, made room in the center for bombs. And then uh, I think I actually went eight from here. One, two, three, four, five, seven. Something like that. I put a floor in here, right? I moved this back a little bit. Captain's chair. get the idea now there's not much to it really here I'm gonna I'm gonna cut that and move this way yeah In, a little more of this, a little more of that, you know. Basically, at this point, right, the rest is just development. And then now, like, you know, how do you want to close in the engine, for example? Um, you know, that's what I did on the last one. Just like that, so to speak. Yeah, so that's going to do it for part one of the build. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.